This is Sport Ray 16. For this video here is going to be a bit of an update. Now, before I get this update video started, there is something that I need to tell you people. And the thing of it is, something within the family has happened recently. It is that of, well, I was told last Friday evening from my mom was that well, my grandpa passed away and and before before all that happened was that on the day before Thanksgiving his body was not doing too well and my parents had to take him to the hospital and it was found out that he was go was suffering through slight kidney failure, a bit of an pneumonia, and his lungs were just not working the way they should have. And he was in there for about like probably say two, two and a half weeks, probably close to three. And it was on that Friday evening that his his lungs just gave out. Or basically his body just gave out on him and he passed right then and there. Now, as of currently right now, with um, this video being recorded on December 12th, um, my grandpa's visitation is going to be the day after this video is recording, which is going to be the 13th, and his funeral is going to be on the morning of the 14th. Now, I myself will not be going to the visitation or funeral because it would just be way too hard on me and I wouldn't exactly feel comfortable doing so because I, I definitely had a hard time doing so when it came to visitation for my grandma when she passed away in, on January 18th of 2013. And well, Again, visitation from my grandma was really hard, so it would just be impossible for me, for my grandpa, because I really loved my grandpa, and I mean, if he would still be alive today, or to his birthday, which is, I think it was December 29th, he would have been 88 years old. And... As for me and my family, well, things are going to stay relatively fine for a while. But the fact that uh, without my grandpa's income, thing, things financially are going to be a bit different, but we'll, we'll still be fine. So, so yeah. Now, the thing of it is, even though for us financially things are going to be different, um, for me, the things that I have planned for 2018 will still be there. Now, for, what, for the things that I have so far planned for 2018, which is going to be that in March, um, March 3rd, I am going to be attending Monster Jam. I mean... <laughs> I can even show you guys the tickets that I, uh, my mom got me. So I pretty much right here. So I, so I pretty much put this. So I basically say Marshall Jam, pretty much Dome at the Mega Center, and even even got a pit pass. So I'll be able to head down there to the floor, get to see all the trucks and meet all the drivers. Well, hopefully I'll be able to get to meet all the drivers. So that that'll be a wonderful time coming March third, and 
also for Anime St. Louis next year. I'm I'm still pretty much going for that because, well, I'm already registered and all that, and all that needs to be taken care of is the hotel, and that's hopefully not not to be a big issue there. But yeah, I'm I'm still for a go for Anime St. Louis next year. But for Anime St. Louis's for for the years after that, I really don't know. For like. I really don't know if I'll be able to make it for like 2019, 2020 and onwards. But for 2018, I'm pretty much set. Um, also, also think of it as for me that I'm wanting to decide to do for my for, for my life in the future is to become a photographer. Yep, I'm actually planning to become a photographer. But not just a regular one. Ho 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 no. I am wanting to be a cosplay photographer. Yeah. I'm actually wanting to become a cosplay photographer. But in order for me to actually become a cosplay photographer, I still need to understand the ba the um the ins and outs of regular photography. Which I have managed to find some online lessons. Cause I understand like the basics. You stole my heart of gold after my silver soul. Can you dig in?